Good morning. How are y'all doing today? Um, we are actually on our way to do the Tal Talamino. Talamina Scenic Drive. Scenic Drive. And we got Caitlin. She's ready. You ready? She got a little snack. She don't like getting her car seat right now. Yeah, Megan missed out. She's uh, she's actually riding in the back seat because I have Miko in the front seat and he's bigger than she is. Well, kind of. She. She. Sorry. <laughs> he keeps calling our dog a he and it's a she. Yeah. But um, but yeah. So we're gonna take you along the ride. Um, so have a good day. Okay, these are good memories that'll come back that she'll be able to look back on and say, you know what, I was there. I yeah, slept I through it. Through it but I, was there. I was there. Alright, we're good. Oh look at that. That would be a fourth part. driving in a Jeep or, or 
modern vehicle. I've done it on motorcycles. Um, actually had a gold link. This has been probably five, six years ago. But uh, on, on the weekend, this, this scenic drive actually has traffic. It's, I mean, bumper-to-bumper uh, -bumper traffic. It's that popular. Um, so it's, it's kind of nice to, to come during the middle of the week um, and have the road pretty much to yourself. And my ears are popping. Oh yeah, mine too. I'm glad Caitlin's asleep. <laughs> Look, and the sun pop. Yep. There's a sign up there. And uh, this will tell you that Golden Eagle, sometimes seen soaring above the mountains, may have named the town of Eagleton. It was established in the 1890s with the coming of the Kansas City Southern Railroad. Absolutely gorgeous. As you can tell, it is just about sunset here and uh, Broken Bow at uh, the Hochitown, Hochiton RV Park. I wanted to kind of give you a kind of a glimpse of how we set ourselves up at night. We, um, we chose not to go so much with the um, with the canopy on the RV, um, I like our canopy. It it matches our theme. Uh, we are from Texas, and um, in the daytime, I think you've seen it. And if you haven't, I'll, I'll hit another picture of it at, at uh, in the daytime. But it is a uh, red, white, and blue, which is. Most people would say that's very American of you. It's not, it's very Texan of me. Uh, the paint scheme that we went with on the RV, we actually painted that. Um, and again, I don't know if you can really kind of see it. And if not, I'll, again, I'll get another shot. Uh, it matches the Jeep. Um, I am in a Jeep club and um, 
that doesn't matter. But uh, my Jeep is, is, is my toy, and it is my, uh, my toad also. But uh, it's red, white, and blue. The name of the Jeep is Lone Star. And uh, the rig uh, matches the Jeep on the paint scheme. But that's kind of our, our, uh, our lighting at night. And we've got our campfire going with our torches. Um, and then our, uh, our canopy underneath uh, that over, over, overhangs our picnic table. The things that I'm going to probably add to the RV, um, I've got right now I've got a TV uh, underneath one of our bays with a uh, Bluetooth speaker. Uh, we're probably going to make that front um, basement bay an entertainment center because we do like to sit out when we're when we're out and it's not raining and and we can enjoy it. Um, and sometimes we'll we'll watch a movie or watch TV. Uh, if not, we've always got our music playing, and um, we're going to make that an entertainment center. So, more more on that to come. Uh, we are going to do a complete tour of the RV. There's still a lot of work that we're doing on a remodel, and uh, that'll be another video that we've got coming up. But I just kind of wanted you to see what we uh, how we kind of relax in the evening. Well, sing for Papa.